Hello everyone and welcome back to Lizzie in Disneyland. Before I start today's video, please make sure to subscribe to my channel and click that little bell icon so that you're always notified when I post. Today's video is going to be slightly different as it's not my own collection I'm showing you. This is my mum's salt and pepper collection that we have collected from the Disney parks and eBay over the years. Now my mum has collected salt and pepper pots for quite a long time now, but I'm just going to show you the Disney ones. The first one I'm going to show you we got from Walt Disney World on our trip in 2015 and it's the Dumbo. As you can see, Minnie and Mickey come out. They are magnetic and you can see that's where you fill them up and there are his holes. And same with Minnie. So they magnetically attach in there so that they don't fall out. And they've got little hands, as you can see, to hold on to Dumbo so that they fit in place. Next one, I can't remember whether we got them from Walt Disney World or from Disneyland, but they are the Mickey treats. You've got the Mickey premium bar with his holes and the Mickey Rice Krispie Treat. My mum especially loves collecting things that are the treats and she really wished she had got the fridge magnets on our last trip. Now this is a set that was from British Home Stores which has now closed down but they are beautiful, they are very big. They would actually be very good to actually use but we don't use any of the Disney salt and pepper pots in the house. I believe the ones that we are using at the moment are little cupcakes. So there is Mickey and there is Minnie. Primark did a similar set recently which my mum's best friend Verity bought for her and there they are. They are a little bit smaller and they are both Minnie Mouse and they are adorable. These ones live on our fireplace and the rest are in a cabinet which is now full. A more recent one that I bought my mum from eBay, I believe they were for Christmas, were these frozen ones. They are magnetic as you can see so they stand together and there are their little holes and the holes are on the back so they're hidden. I really like these. There is also a set of Anna and Elsa as children making Olaf which if I could find for a good price I would buy for my mum. My mum loves Snow White and Mary Poppins which unfortunately we don't have a salt and pepper set for but we do have Snow White. I thought she was magnetic but she's actually not. You just have to pose them together. I suppose it's because you wouldn't really want a magnet on his bald head because it would look weird when they're not together. But I think they're really cute. There is her holes. And there is his. They're quite out of the way so you don't really notice them if you're looking at them head on. Another one my mum got are these bride and groom ones. Now my parents did celebrate their 25th wedding anniversary when we were in Florida so these are most likely from there but I really can't remember. Their holes are hidden on the back of their head and you fill them up at the bottom. I feel really bad that I don't know any of the stories of these but I have a terrible memory and it's usually me buying these. So these are the Lady and the Tramp ones. There are their holes. I really like these but I wish they were magnetic like Anna and Elsa because then they would just sit together. It is really hard for me to remember which ones we got from the parks and which ones we didn't but because we actually went in November I do strongly believe that we got these from Florida because um, it was so close to Christmas that my mum would have wanted to buy these and I know they are in the parks. So there are the holes. Now this is a set that I absolutely know I bought my mum off eBay because it took weeks to come from America and I think it arrived one week before her birthday because these were a birthday present. So they are Woody and Buzz. These ones are magnetic, but Buzz, Buzz's magnet is actually stuck to Woody, so they don't really work as well as they should. But there 
are the holes they're quite hidden on woody especially and if it did work properly they would look really cute together i don't know whether you know this but my dad's favorite character is tigger so we had to have these in my mum's regular salt and pepper collection she has an elvis salt and pepper pot because it is my dad's favourite singer and she also has an Only Fools and Horses set because that's one of my dad's favourite TV shows. So you can see how things that my dad loves comes into what my mum loves. So if they start doing an Iron Man salt and pepper set I am sure we'll end up with those as well. So there are their holes, they're really well hidden on Tigger and there you go. My mum also really loves Peter Pan so I had to get her these, I'm holding them the wrong way. I had to get her these from eBay. These are magnetic, so they look as though they're fighting. I wish Peter was done a little better, and Hook for that matter, but I really like them. There are their holes. Now this one has a funny story to it. I wanted to get my mum the Four Parks Salt and Pepper Pot collection. You've got a little Epcot, a Sorcerer Mickey hat for Hollywood Studios, the castle for Magic Kingdom and the Tree of Life for Animal Kingdom. However, it got lost in the post, so I messaged the lady on eBay to ask if she could track it and after a couple of weeks she said, um, I'll just replace them for you, but she couldn't get the ones that I'd originally asked for, so she sent me this Peter Pan's flight one instead, which even though I would have really loved the original one for my mum, this is still perfect because Peter Pan's flight is her favourite ride. So there are the holes. They're not magnetic, which I actually think would work better because he just rattles and I get really worried about him. But mum was really happy with this anyway. I just really wanted to find the four parks set for her. The final one is actually available in our country now on the Shop Disney website. Is this Tangled set. Now Tangled is one of my favourite films so I think she has this one for me really. There are the holes. The only problem with this one is that the size difference. I mean we only have salt in our house anyway but for someone who likes salt as much as pepper they'd have to decide which one they cared about more or used more. But they are really cute how they magnetically attach to make the tower and her hair is cascading down it and I just think it's really cute. Thank you so much for watching this YouTube video. Please remember to give it a like and a comment and don't forget to subscribe to my videos. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon.